birthday peeps, you cancers. I want to say thank you for being here. Okay. Um, cancers, wow. Your birthdays are coming up and it is uh, such, such, really, 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 really. Um, this period cancer is just unbelievable. So you have to be on top of your game cancers just uh, be on top of your games because this year is going to be a year of uh, a lot of changes okay you're going to be dealing with a lot really a lot of changes so you got to be on top of your game i want to say to each and every person the quarter readings is out so go check out the quarter readings um it is wonderful um, the quarter readings because what they do for you is that they give you some a form of uh, um, knowing what is coming up so you can basically prepare yourself for that okay um, I want to say to you guys it is a really um, uh, a shift of change that is coming up on this planet um you know protect yourself from this heat wave because there's heat wave that is coming up on this planet um a lot of countries um north american and that sort of a thing this change of uh, what is transpiring on this planet is, is just affecting a lot of people go out and get the information don't listen to other people try and find help there is a uh, um uh the shift in 5d listen to that kent dunn and romonius um there is a lot of people out there who have the correct information to help you guys okay because i know that it is uh, quite weird and a lot of stuff is going on for you guys you want to know what's going on but there's a lot of changes that is coming up okay and this is good so be aware, um, be open to the things that is coming up um, because there is a lot that is going to be coming up. Um, Health-wise, um, there is a lot of shift that is going to be coming up. A lot of you are going to be um, feeling this shift, however this is happening and transpiring. A lot of you are going to be feeling this shift. So be aware of what is happening and transpiring i'm going to give these cards um uh i'm going to give these cards a shuffle and then we're going to be going in and the window is so open and it's still it's just blazing hot here ladies and gentlemen so um we're going to be um trying um to do this i'm standing um this week uh because of the heat it's just all over the world that this is happening so um be aware so okay birthday peeps if your birthday is from the 29th of uh, um june until the 5th of july this is your birthday readings okay so if your birthday is from the 29th of june until the 5th of july this is your birthday reading so let's see what's coming out so i see the energy of justice um so if we're born on 29th of june you're going to be receiving the energy of justice whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring justice is here so um, this is about balancing issues, situation, karmas, um, where the energy of justice is coming up in a very, very positive way. And it is about clearing karmas, okay? Having um, the chance to clear karmas between you and others. And it's going to be very, very, very important. So there is, um, uh, um, without a Jew, and um, without even thinking about it, there is going to be just so much that is going to be happening when it comes on to justice. So justice um, comes up in different ways and it is about changing the shape 
of the planet okay and what is going on on the planet so um this is what is going to be affecting a lot of you most of you i should say um that is born on um the 29th okay so what other energies is coming up um so we have justice on the king of cups whoever this person is uh, um i see um you young men justice is going to be coming up on you so if you were um if you have done something um injustice i see justice is coming up on you young men or young people okay so if you're in in, in between the ages of uh, um let's say you're in the ages of 18 and 45 i see um where you're going to be dealing with some karmatic justice so it is um it is um really a year where it's it's all about releasing situation for you older people um it is going to be okay but for the young people um 15 yeah the young people 15 to 45 justice is coming up now life is full of surprises because um it is as if you have to clear some sort of a karma um that is coming in okay so it is about clearing karmas um understanding that um you need to clear your karmas you need to um clear issues from past lifetime so um that is really what is going to be transpiring now when we look at that sort of energy so we have to find out uh, what um has transpired um why this situation is coming up in this year and i see you're going to be working together with other people in order to resolve an issue and a situation so i see that most of you whatever um this balancing is all about it's all about coming together and working with other people in order to create this balance in your world I see a reunion that is going to be coming up for some of you. Um, so um, some of you who have divorced might uh, reunite and this is going to be good. Whatever is transpiring, whoever is divorced might reunite uh, um, in this um, time period. So that is a, a really good. Then we see um, some of you are going to be working together with someone from another country, another religion another race in order to resolve a issue and a situation and i see that there might be a reunion that is going to be coming up so it is a year of um, reclaiming healing and whatever issues whatever situation that was transpiring it's a, really a year about uh, um, reclaiming your power healing issues and situation that was transpiring so we're moving on to the people who were born the 30th of June. <laughs> I love these cards. The people who are born on the 30th of June, we have the energy of the devil. This is a situation where you're going to be releasing yourself from some bounded issue, some bounded situation that was happening and transpired. You're definitely going to be releasing yourself from this so however and well how, however it was happening if you were bounded to um situation in your life i see a resolution is definitely going to be coming up and changes is going to be coming in so if there was a deceptiveness in your world if you were chained and bounded by someone i see that you're going to be releasing this some of you were chained and bound by the prince of wands okay so some of you were really um dealing with um a situation where you were bounded by the prince of wands now whoever this prince of wands is this is the energy that you're going to be dealing with in this year and this prince of wands is an aries leo or a sagittarius and whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring if you are being attacked negatively attacked it is a young 
fire sign person which is a very deceptive person but whatever they're doing is not going to affect in you because you're going to be ending whatever they have done so they have done some nasty um deceptive situation and you know it's like time is catching up on these people whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring time is catching up because this um energy is from a fire sign person and it's a young fire sign person an aries leo a sagittarius whoever this person is they could use like someone to do some negative situation to you okay but whatever is transpiring it's not going to be happening because even if you're having some backlash from this trust me um this um situation you are definitely going to be overcoming so there is just some really um nasty people in this world and um yes um it's a fire sign person whoever this fire sign person is it could be a family member it could be an ex-partner a family member or an ex-partner whoever this person is it's a very deceptive person okay and you have to be aware of this person this person is a young person an aries leo or a sagittarius a very very deceptive person so um a lot of you are going to be dealing with marriages relationships so family issues that sort of a thing is going to be coming up for a lot of you in this year and whatever the issue is and the situation that is transpiring i see these family issues is coming up with a fire sign person and i see you need to this person is really um deceptive and you need to stand your ground with this person so whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring you need to open up your heart to this person this person is a very very young deceptive person and whatever they have done and however they ever uh, um they're doing it they're very very they're 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 in a really nasty horrible person okay so then we see um this energy of uh, um it's your enemy um it's a young you young men are the grand senor or people between the ages of 18 and 45. And I see that you're dealing with this devil energy. Okay, so some of you could be cheating. Some of you could be playing the game. You have a wife. You have other people in your world. You, however, it is happening and transpiring. I see this sort of a cheating game that is happening and transpiring. I see you men, grand senor is a the man the marriage and friends so this is what i'm saying so this is a year where you need to clean up your hack i see a lot of playing i see a lot of you are going to be playing the field so you got to clean up your act whatever is happening and transpiring especially for um the young men okay but for the rest of you it's all about family it's all about um friendship it's all about relationship the soulmate is a year you can meet your soulmate as we move forward to the people who were born on the 1st of July, the energy of the Empress, and this is very beautiful, are really positive alignments of energy where your materialistic wealth is a year of nurturing and your materialistic wealth and whatever that was creating obstacles blocking your materialistic wealth, this is now going to be over. So this is going to be good. Um, so the negative forces that was blocking your financial inflow to your financial source is going to be released. So congratulations um, to you people who were born. And what this is saying is that uh, if some of you could not get pregnant also, this is going to be a year that you are going to be getting pregnant. Okay, so if you are having issues with uh, um, getting pregnant, all your burdens is over twice so you have a double whammy whatever issues you are going through people who were born on the 1st of July whatever issues you were going through your burdens is now going to be over and this is going to be good so it is really a good year for the people who were born the 1st of July because what is happening here and what is transpiring is that your burdens double twice your burdens is going to be over so your materialistic world that was blocked a ship is coming up and um it's releasing whatever that was transpiring so let's say that you couldn't have a child 
materialistic, you couldn't have a child, whatever that was happening and transpiring, this is going to be definitely, definitely be resolved and this is going to be wonderful. So that is a wonderful alignment of energy for the people who were born the 1st of July. I see a lot of you were hoping and wishing um, for this moment, this time to come in. Yes, it is here. I see a lot of you is going to be releasing and um, ending marriages relationship and I see new love is going to be returning. So this is wonderful. Whoever was open for the resolution of uh, um, a marriage or the end of a relationship, it's definitely going to be happening. And what we're seeing also is that a new love is going to be coming in. For some of you, I see that if you have your partner or husband in jail, this person could be coming out. Okay, so if you have your, your partner or your husband in jail, I see that this person could be um, leaving jail. They could be coming out. So um, that is one of the most um, happiest moments that some of you are going to be having. But most of all, the burdens is going to be over. <laughs> yeah, most of all, the burdens is definitely going to be over. So be aware of that. Okay, now we're moving on to the people who were born the 2nd of June. The energy of the 2nd of June, um, we are having um, the situation where we are seeing that the hermit, the hermit is here. And the energy with the hermit is about you seeking the truth, going to find the truth about an issue or a situation. Seeking the truth to, resol um, to resolve a situation. Seeking the truth about a new love that is in your life okay seeking the truth so i see a lot of you are going to be seeking the truth seeking the truth about a new love in your life whoever this new love is um some of you could be seeking um the truth about this person some of you are seeking to find out what love is um this is also a possibility that some of you are really seeking to find out what a real love is okay and um some of you could also be um looking for love and, and and this is a year where i see that some of you really just want to find that person that person that completes you that person that makes you feel good about yourself that person that really um make your world shines okay and i see that you are going to be finding this person the energy of the star some of you are healing yourself and learning to love more. Whatever, however, this is transpiring, you're healing yourself and trying to love yourself more. So the energy with the start is going to be a good year. Um, if you're doing whatever you're doing, uh, whatever business you're doing, whatever your work is, I see you're going to be very successful at that. Okay. Um, you're going to be finding um, that um, job, that uh, a business idea that makes you feel good about doing something. So this is a really, really positive. The hermit and love is um, really good with the energy of the star. Um, this is actually a good year for you guys. It doesn't really matter how it comes up. It's definitely a good year, especially for you guys who were born the second of July with the hermit and love is a really positive alignment of energy with the energy of the star it is beautiful um however way you look at the energy of the star it is really a beautiful thing and whoever is looking for love whoever decided to get married in this year the marriage is going to last a lifetime so that is really wonderful and positive then we see some investigation that is transparent, but you're going to be successful. So I see they were investigating something, but I see that you're going to be very, very successful and you're going to be overcoming your enemy. So they're, they, they are definitely investigating. Some of you have a male enemy that you were not aware of. And I see they're investigating this person and I see you're going to be successful because successful is... Uh, in the middle and um, some of you were in a relationship um with your enemy and you were not aware of it and this person has created some um 
deception stolen from you and i see um that you're going to be investigating this person and you're going to be successfully overcoming um what this person has done to you okay so there is a lot that is going on so i see an investigation that is happening and transpiring and this male enemy is definitely some of you women were in a relationship the relationship um went sour and i see um they're um investigating this person because some of you were either abused or hurt by this person okay so you were either abused or hurt by this person or this person could have stolen a lot from you and they are really and it's really a male that has done it to some of you women and i see they're investigating the situation so that is good let's move on to the people who was born on the third you have the energy of um i just really wish i could read without my glasses um the energy oh you ladies oh this is so wonderful okay so i see you ladies 50 years and older could be meeting your twin flame oh my god this is so powerful okay so ladies 50 years and older this year is going to affect your marriage or some of you could be meeting your twin flame and it doesn't really matter if even you are very very old you still could be still meeting your twin flame so i see that you ladies are going to be the center ladies 50 years and older is going to be the center of uh, this year this is going to be good because it's all about marriage and twin flame okay some of you could be finding out that you are married to your twin flame or some of you are going to be realizing and meeting your twin flame there is going to be issues with marriage that is going to be coming up so we let's look at what is coming up but it's all about marriage kids and that sort of thing i see you're going to be financially supported um by your partner so whatever is coming up i see that you're definitely going to be financially supported by your partner i see money is going to be coming in some of you god forgive oh god forbid maybe your husband is passing away and he's going to be making sure that you're financially some of you ladies might be remarried especially older ladies might decide to remarry i see financial stability is going to be coming in for you ladies 50 years and older yeah the money is returning to you ladies so let's say that um some money was stolen or taken from you um by this person by someone um let's say that it is a situation where you're dealing with um your pension your, your husband or your partner has passed away and it is a situation with your pension and i see that um a whole lot of money is going to be um given to you ladies 50 years and older okay because this is as if it's a pension um a pension from your husband um or money that was stolen from you ladies is going to be returned so this is um really really good and i see that some of you who are divorcing you're going to be ending this divorce in a very very um having and being very financial stable i told you some of you ladies could be finding out that your husband or your partner have cheated and i see you're divorcing this person and um some of you who where money was stolen from you um that um someone played you and has stolen a lot of money from you um it is coming up that you it will be returned but i see some of you are going to be finding out that your partner has cheated on you and uh, um because it's right on top of the lover so there is something about a theft so it could have been um your partner had cheated on you it is a situation with a theft and something to do with a bank so i see that um some of you ladies could find out that your family member whether your father whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring that they could have stolen from you okay they could have stolen from you and um whatever is happening and transpiring um yeah i see the bank is going to be alerting some of you some of you are going to re realize that family member 
have stolen from you and you gotta be um it's gonna be very surprising for some of you um but the money is going to be returned so um ask for a personalized reading because this is like someone else do it and it shows up so it's as your child or your husband or however it came up so be aware of what is transpiring so we are moving on um to the people who were born on um the fort and what we have here is that we have a new start for the people who were born on the fourth of july happy fourth of july <laughs> Oh my god okay so happy 4th of july um yeah abundancy abundancy celebration abundancy i don't know what it's going to be looking like this year ladies and gentlemen because god knows um uh, god knows ladies and gentlemen because instead of it's getting God knows, but for who were born on the 4th of July, happy 4th of July, okay? I am wishing you guys, really, it's going to be a wonderful year for you guys. It's as if celebration, it's as if now it's really independence because all the stuff that is coming out, it is going to be as if it is really independence, okay? So, um, all the people who were born on the 4th of July, congratulations. It, it's just as if you're going to be released because the changes that is coming up on this planet. And this is why I say to a lot of people, stay in, do not get in these people, these crazy people, um, thing, um, <laughs> black life matters, but, um, we have been centuries on this planet and nothing has changed. Okay. People are just creating chaos so that you people can join in it. First, it was uh, the virus, and then it is now black life, and then they they just gonna bring you. They're, 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 you are like a puppet, okay? Do you see the energy of the devil when the 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 devil hold two people? That is what is happening. Do not, do not, and I'm telling you people, do not go to these things. If you need something to change, you got to write a letter, get 3200 um, people to sign it, send it to Congress. Do not, they are using you like a puppet on a string to go out there smashing things. Um, for, since Martin Luther King and JFK has passed away, it has never, ever changed anything, okay? Free yourself, independent yourself, and free yourself from the chains of these people who have been uh, keeping us as slaves on this planet. Okay? Now, oh my God, this is such a beautiful, um, beautiful, beautiful um, message that is coming out for you guys. This is absolutely fabulous. Okay? Yeah, I'm moving around. <laughs> I'm moving around because I'm changing up um, how I do my um, reading and uh, it is a reason why, but it's just kind of weird. Um, and ladies and gentlemen, it is not easy doing the work that I do. You have um, evil people. News is coming in, that changes is coming in. You are about, you have successfully and is celebrating and is successfully overcoming a situation some of you are going to be having a new start a new start victory and success is coming up and you're going to be having a new start okay victory and success is coming up i see a lot of you are hoping hoping um for a new start open for um to travel hoping um to create a better tomorrow yes 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 it is going to be happening in this year for you guys oh yes it is definitely definitely going to be happening now i see some of you ladies young ladies could be very sad some of you young ladies could be very sad so if you were born on the 4th of july i see sadness sadness could be coming up and this is for young people between the age of 18 and 45 could be very very sad i see this young lady has gotten some news and this is a very, very sad news. 
So some of you are going to be saddened, especially young ladies between the ages of 18 and 45. It's going to be saddened because of some news that they have received. And it is definitely, um, they were hoping for a new start and it's not going to be happening. For you older people, it's not affecting you, but especially young ladies between the ages of 18 and 45, I see that um, they are going to be saddened um, because they were hoping and wishing for a, a new start. And um, you are cancers and you were hoping and wishing for some new start. So young ladies that is born the fourth of, uh, and not all of you, just um, people who have done things, try to get away with it and they are now caught, okay? Uh, victory and success for the people who are born the fifth of july victory and success oh my god and you have also the let me look at it this looks like the wheel of fortune oh my god <laughs> oh, 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 oh my god i don't know okay i love this i love this so people who are born the 5th of july victory and success whatever is happening whatever is transpiring really victory and success and this is coming in very 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 fast a fast space this is coming in fast this is so wonderful so beautiful victory and success is here for you and i see things are going to be changing fast for you it's like um speed in this year things are going to be changing fast victory and success overcoming difficulties that was created around you and surviving all this negative negative situation that was happening i see some of you are definitely um if you have a business it's going to be really successful um whatever the worries was it is now over you overcome a situation you overcome some sadness that was happening for the people who were born the 5th of july you have definitely overcome some sadness that was happening and transpiring. You have overcome a situation with a scorpion, whoever the scorpion was, whatever they were doing, whatever that was transpired. I see you overcome a situation and I see a Leo is going to go to jail, whatever is transpiring. You overcome the situation and Leo is going to be going to, to jail. So some of you could have been dealing with a Leo that has done some deceptive situation and a Leo is going to be going to jail. I see your business is going to be very, very good. I see a lot of clients. Business is going to be coming in to you. I see a lot of, it's as if all of a sudden a, a shower is coming in to your business. Whatever a Leo has done, this Leo has been caught, is going to be caught in this year. Some of you are going to be finding out that this Leo had a block on your business and this person is um, definitely going to be caught. So my birthday peeps, it is going to be a year of materialistic abundance. It's going to be a year of changing. It's a year of meeting the soul's mate. Okay. It's a year where you guys are going to be um, getting married. Okay. Um, definitely. So whatever that is um applying in your life at this moment it is going to be this year that is coming up is going to be absolutely absolutely fabulous and this is going to be so positive because you start off the year um with justice and uh, you are going to be a victory victory and success is going to be coming in for you so wonderful alignment of energies that is happening and transpiring. However, that was dealing with some um, issues. You're going to be um, really coming out of this issue and it's going to be wonderful. I'm saying namaste until next time. Enjoy. Go and check out your weekly readings. I got it. Go.